good morning welcome back to my channel or welcome to my channel if you are new here today as you would have already seen by the title i am going to be trying to conquer the 10,000 calorie challenge i honestly never thought i would end up doing this but i asked you guys what you wanted to see for like a hundred thousand subscriber video and my most requested was the 10,000 calorie challenge so thanks guys i'm assuming you want me to do this so you don't have to but yes i'm going to be trying to do that today i look really tired i don't know why so let's just ignore that also wearing my comfy clothes because comfort is key especially when you're eating so many calories i want to be comfortable i need a big flowy shirt and that's what we've got today so yes ryan is going to be coming along with me he's currently down sitting with theo who's probably going to be on a lot of our journeys as well to go and get food and basically eat as much as i can i honestly don't know if I'm going to be able to hit 10,000 calories. I'm obviously going to try, but I don't want to force food into me until I'm extremely uncomfortable. I just don't think that's smart. I'm going to so, help. Ryan's going to help. He's going to be with me. We're going to start out with some McDonald's breakfast along with some Krispy Kremes because I figured I could eat a lot of that and it doesn't really fill me up. So yes, we'll see how we go. I honestly don't know how I'm going to go today. I could surprise myself and be able to easily eat 10,000 calories, but we shall see. So stay tuned. Give this video a thumbs up if you're ready to see me eat 10,000 calories and also subscribe if you haven't. And thank you so much to all you guys that have already subscribed. That is why I'm doing this video. So yes, I will see you at McDonald's. Bye. Right, off we go to get the first meal of the day. I honestly think I look really tired because I haven't had coffee or breakfast yet. And it's currently... Quarter past nine. Quarter past nine. Hopefully you can see that. I'm going to keep updating you on the time and when I'm eating and whatnot. I'm also going to be calculating my calories on my fitness pal, which I have made an account. Apparently my stats say that I'm supposed to be eating six, 1,650. We're not going to be eating that much today. We're going to be eating about... What will that be? Four times that? <laughs> uh, no, no, it's over five Just times. Oh, oh really? Over yeah. five times? Oh, I feel that's, okay. that's for us tonight. Literally me tonight when Almost I'm in exploded. an actual food coma. I'm so scared, but should be fine. After this, I'm going to eat super good. Doing it for you guys. 100,000, 10,000 calories. For 100, yeah, for 100,000. I don't know, you're, you you might not like food after this. It might be a good thing. Could be. I'm definitely going back to just one cheat meal a week after this, but I'm just going to enjoy today. I'm very excited for donuts. It's probably the only time today that I'm going to be actually hungry, so I'm just going to enjoy it. <laughs> Where is mum? I know you miss her, don't you? She's buying donuts. Oh yeah, can I just get four boxes, please? <gasps> Look. What's mum got? Uh, yeah, yeah, just three just boxes of donuts, thanks. <laughs> Right, first donut because I'm super hungry. I got 10 original glaze and then one, it came with one strawberry one and one chocolate one. So there's 12 total and I'm just going to eat them throughout the day just to clock up some calories. But right now I'm so hungry so I have to eat this. Mm. Oh god. One down. 11 more to go. <laughs> Honestly. That in itself would be a struggle. How do you think I'm going to do today? I don't know. I mean, you've seen me eat a lot of food. Through one meal. I don't know how much do you think you usually do on a normal cheat day? Like 5,000? Over 5,000, maybe, hey. maybe like four. Depends what I get for lunch and dinner. I guess you didn't you say five hash browns is like 1,600 or something? Oh no, mm -hmm. five hash browns and no. five Krispy Kremes. Mm -hmm. Oh gosh, okay. Yeah, and then one. The meal that I always get from KFC, which is like the Zinger Ultimate Box, yeah, is like a thousand. So I reckon yeah. I only eat about four, which is still a lot, obviously, but like that's Just. me filling myself to the brim basically on like cheat day. I only eat till I'm comfortable on cheat day, but like I only eat till I'm comfortable on cheat day, and that's only 4,000 calories, so like. <laughs> but that's why I'm getting donuts and things like this. Like I don't normally do this. So. Yeah, high calories. Mm -hmm. Well, we can only see. I don't think you'll. I don't know if you'll reach ten thousand, but you'll. I reckon you'll get up there. I could get to like seven or eight. I reckon eight. I reckon you get to eight, mm -hmm. and you'll be like, oh. Mhm. Mm oh my god. Okay. See so you at McDonald's, and I also need to go into police and choose a bunch of snacks that I can just shove down, clock up some cows. Oh my god, this sounds so bad. Yeah, it looks good to me. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> we've been put in the waiting bay because we've ordered too much food, too many hash browns. I got some 
chocolate bars at the shops. I got Bunos, Buenos, Buenos, Buenos. Buen. I don't know. A Kit Kat gold bar. Oh my god, these are amazing. I also got a Hershey's cookies and cream. We have a packet of Freddo heads. I'm literally gonna die. We have my favorite chocolate eggs. Of course, I could go through these easily. I feel like I should start eating these now. I also have a chunky Kit Kat bar. This one is gooey caramel. I really wanted to try that. We also have. I I'm like. Not mad. I know. <laughs> what do you mean? I went mad choosing. Yeah. I have to like. And then I got some Pringles, sweet chili and sour cream. They Yum. sounded really good, right? And then good old sauna vinegar chips. She got two packets of those. I bet you could eat two packets easy. Maybe. We can just stay, do another store run for lunch. Yeah, if, if we need some more snacks, we can go. But I honestly think like that'll pop up to a lot of calories, right? <laughs> oh, um, yeah. <sighs> All right, time for the first meal. Hopefully you can hear us all the way over there. But basically, I think I'm just gonna time lapse bunch of this eating otherwise it's going to get really boring and I want you guys to see that I actually am eating all of this as well obviously oh my god look at how many of these ones there are and after every single meal I'm just going to pop up the calories of that meal as well which will hopefully be a lot mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I'll show you the oh my gosh that's so that is what the Marty McMuffin looks like Oh my god, that looks actually amazing. Oh my god. Theo's at the door. He's already crying. We left Theo outside, otherwise he would have literally just been jumping all over us, yelping to get up on the bed. Let's do this, first meal. We are currently watching Ted Bundy and it's really really good and we're addicted so I think that's what we're going to be watching most of the day whilst we're eating. Donut number two going down. Mm -mm. I'm just going to keep telling you when I'm shoving a new one in my mouth instead of filming the whole time because my camera is just going to keep on dying. Just thought I would give another little update. It is currently, wow, it's already 11 o'clock. So it's 10.57 right now. I've had another donut. I'm about to have another one. And the amount of calories I have had so far is... 1,598 which is nearly more than I have every day and it's honestly freaking me out a little bit It's making me nervous. I don't normally eat this much obviously um, But I'm trying not to let it worry me too much. It's only one day. It'll be fine It's just so crazy. So I'm going to eat another donut and Keep chilling out I guess mm, Donut number three I'm joining you. Ryan's joining me now Oh my god, these are so good though. And they are very easy to eat, so I'm really glad that I picked these up. This building in Miami, Florida, deliberating for six and a half hours. That's how I feel the right now. Just past 
Number four. So, I'm going to set up a YouTube video. Oh, yes. I love Lauren Curtis's um, try on hauls. They're always so good. So, I'm going to watch that, eat some snacks, but I'll show you what I'm trying first. Maybe I should try something new. I'll try this one because I think this is the only one I bought that I haven't tried before. So, this is the Kit Kat Chunky Gooey Caramel. Mm. And it is, the whole thing is 2,150 kilojoules. I wish it was calories, that would be handy, but it's not, unfortunately. So I'm just gonna eat this. I figured I don't wanna eat too much because I kinda need to save room for a big meal. It's probably the smartest way to do it is to eat all the biggest, like high calorie things first and then try and stuff these in to like get more calories. Yeah, I'm just gonna have one chocolate bar and then go and get some chaos food because we worked out that that's like the highest calorie meal you can get out of like McDonald's, Red Star. What else would there be? Domino's I guess you could probably do, but I think KFC would be the best. Mmm. Tastes like a Kit Kat with caramel in it. <laughs> Probably what you'd think it would taste like, a caramel Kit Kat. Mm. Mm -hmm. Oh my god. I also just saw that Shane Dawson's new video is out. Woo I'm set for today. I've also got I've also got I've also got PT later at four o'clock, so I'm sure she's gonna like destroy me because I told her that I'm doing this. Kit Kat chunky caramel, two hundred and sixty-one calories. Hey, that's pretty good. That's only three hundred calories. Yeah. Okay, add that to my snacks. Now we're at two thousand two hundred and thirty-nine calories. How much more do we have to go? We've only got 7,761 calories to go. Sorry that my aircon is blasting. It is literally disgustingly hot today and I just got in my car, which has been out in the sun. But it is currently, if I can close my phone, 12.50 in the afternoon. So I am off to KFC to pick up a big old meal. I'm on my own, Ryan's opted out. He said he's not very hungry. Hmm. Yeah, and he is not eating as much as me. So yeah, you could say I'm not feeling very hungry either, but I'm definitely not feeling disgustingly full. So I'm gonna go and get a big meal, try and pile in the calories, like I've said, and then kind of keep snacking after that. So let's go to KFC. So I'm currently in the line for some KFC. I ordered the highest kilojoule meal. I got, um, it's like one with a slice, like a wrap in it and a burger and it's Singer, which sounds real good, but I haven't even mentioned the fact that I am gluten intolerant and I've eaten like four donuts, five hash browns, a Mighty McMuffin burger. Now I'm about to have a wrap, fried chicken, a burger. My stomach is seriously going to hate me. Oh my gosh, okay, I'm about to pay a better shot off now. Theo's taking a liking to the KFC. That's not yours. Um, I also quickly wanted to mention that if you are not familiar with the 10,000 calorie challenge, no liquid calories are included, unfortunately. So I've been having water with every meal. Otherwise, you could literally just have like 20 Cokes and then you'd be done with it, which would be kind of boring, but like, probably wouldn't feel as sick. Or maybe you would, I don't know. So I'm going to set up this tripod, get into this KFC if Theo doesn't meet, beat me to it. <laughs> Stop! Oh my God, let's see what's in here. Okay, KFC haul. What have we got? So, the original meal, like the regular meal, sorry, it was 5,200 and something kilojoules, and I got large. So this should be good. If I can get through this, that's like, what is it? I don't know, I'll have to calculate. I don't know what it is. I don't know why I was trying to say what that was just then, but. So, large chippies, my favorite. Chippies are my absolute weakness we have a little wrap which actually looks delicious i was telling them on the way home how i'm gluten intolerant that's oh, gone yeah. out the window today <laughs> uh a zinger burger which is my favorite i love zinger burgers delicious and some potato and gravy i'm making you jealous 
You didn't want anything. And some little uh, popcorn chicken. Uh, Not one. I'll have a popcorn chicken. So, I'm going to watch Shane Dawson's new conspiracy video. And eat my food. Theo's gone to sleep, thank God. Disgusting. There's just a hard bit in this that I'm not enjoying. Some people do this so easy, but I think I'm probably choosing the wrong food. Like, obviously, KFC is gonna be super heavy. I was trying to Google what like the highest calorie cereal is because I feel like you could eat a lot of cereal, but they're all American. So. I need a little break. I'm dying. I've eaten that much chips, nearly all of the little popcorn chicken, that whole wrap, a couple bites of my burger. I'm dying. I was also, when I was driving to get the food, I was sweating bullets. And yeah, it was hot, but once the aircon kicked in, I was still sweating so bad. Like, my boob sweat, I was dripping. And I think it's probably because I've got so much, like, sugar and bad stuff in my system. My body's just, like, getting everything out, like, detoxing me as I'm just moving around. This is hard. Oh, my God. Honestly, prompts to the people that can get through this with ease. Because I've seen some of the girls do this. Like Stephanie Buttermore, like easy, just like smashed it. And other girls like that, they just do so well. And it's all obviously what you choose to eat because other things are easier to eat. But I don't want to fail this. I don't want to disappoint everyone. But oh my God, this is so hard. <laughs> okay, some time has passed because this Shane Dawson conspiracy video is getting really crazy. So I'm feeling a little bit better. So I'm going to have a couple more bites of this burger. I've already had... A little bit more chips so yes I thought I would obviously film when I'm having some more bites I honestly don't think I'll be able to eat that much more but we shall see three bites that's all I can do I literally feel like I could throw up right now I think I'm just gonna have to have my phone a two hour break from food and then try and get back into it and see how I go. I feel so bad. I feel like I'm failing, but this is really hard. Like really hard. <sighs> I will see you guys very soon when I feel a bit better. Ryan? Yes? How do you think I'm going? Not good. <laughs> Not good. <laughs> I literally just spoke to my trainer and said if I feel anything like this right now, like there's no point because I'm just gonna throw up. I tried to eat a few bites of the burger and I literally wanted to run to the toilet and throw up. I'm not even, I'm probably at like 3,000 calories, right? Like, oh, I mean, I've had nearly a whole large chips. A, th a third? Would it be a third like of a burger? I've had like half of what you've eaten, I feel sick. Mm. So I can only imagine what you've eaten. A little like. wrap. I had popcorn chicken. I finished all the popcorn chicken. But oh my god. How do people do this? I feel like a failure. Ugh. I'm sorry. I'm just gonna give you a little update on my stomach right now, just to show you how full I am. Oh, you can't even really tell. It'll be worse at the end of the night, I reckon. Oh, I honestly, it hurts to stand. You can see how full it is. Oh, not good. Not good. Ugh. <laughs> oh, I'm going crazy. Okay. Continuing to rest like I said I was before. 
I just keep updating you because I feel bad. I should be sitting here eating and powering down the calories, but I just can't. <sighs> oh my god. I just deleted the footage where I ate the Zinger Burger because I... Now you're not going to believe me. <sighs> right, well, I just finished the Zinger Burger. Finally, I sat here the whole time and finished that. Three hours later, and I was just adding up the... Cal the <laughs> And because I can't talk, I stopped filming and I deleted it because I was like, alright, I'll add everything up and then I'll just say it and start again. Deleted the whole clip thinking that I just did a new clip trying to calculate everything, but I didn't. But anyways, so with the Zinger Burger that you didn't see me eat, but I definitely did, uh, we are at 3,539 calories. That doesn't include the wrap that I ate because I couldn't find that on the MyFitnessPal app. So I put that into my notes and that is another... 264 calories so I'll add that up now now we're at 3803 calories which is crazy and I'm so annoyed I deleted that clip but I definitely finished that burger um, Theo can vouch for that because he was trying to eat it the whole time weren't you now I guess I'm just gonna chill I'm actually not feeling too bad I just kind of don't want to move I'm in a coma but I'm not feeling physically ill anymore so might chill for a little bit and then maybe I'll try and have a few more donuts, maybe try a few more uh, chocolate stuff. Although I think it's the real sweet stuff that gets me feeling quite sick. So I've got to be careful with that, but we'll see how we go. Okay, now I'm going to have my Kinder Bueno bar, which I absolutely love. I'm just checking on uh, my fitness pal now and it says it's 123 calories. 123 calories. Now that says for one bar, I'm assuming that's the whole thing. That's quite like low in calories. So that's like a muesli bar that you would have like a healthy muesli bar so I'm not sure if it's just for one strip so correct me if I'm wrong but I'm just gonna put it down as one um, and if I'm wrong I guess I did better so we shall see but I'm going to eat this now I love these these are literally my favorite back down again open up a bag of salt and vinegar chips i'm obviously not gonna eat the whole thing i don't really know how i'm gonna calculate this on my fitness pal maybe i'll be able to say like a third of a bag no a quarter of a bag or whatever i eat so i'm just gonna munch on these and see how it goes by the way the time is currently 5 16 in the afternoon <laughs> Okay, I am now finished with these. Once again, I am incredibly full. Um, I don't really know how much I ate. I mean, they're not full to start with, so it's hard to guess, but I think I had about a third. I'm looking on my fitness pal now, and it says a 45 gram pack is 239 calories. So this whole bag is 170 grams. I think I probably ate about 45 grams, maybe a little more. I'm not too sure. So maybe we'll just add that in. I think that should be fine. Not doing very good so far. It's 5.30 right now and I'm dying. I also found out The Rock eats 5,000 calories a day. So maybe I should just rename this video to I eat as many calories as The Rock slash the really unhealthy way. Because that's how I'm feeling this is going to go. I don't think I'm going to get 10,000 calories. Although we're not done yet. But I'm just being realistic. This is really hard. <sighs> Look at this little menace. Wow. <laughs> Oh, you can see that but I'm doing it again. Wait. <laughs> he just keeps licking. What is this, Ryan? Nocturnal animals. Okay. So apparently we're watching Nocturnal Animals. And apparently it starts with a new thing. Thunderstorming. Theme. And it's thunderstorming. We've got good vibes. I'm feeling a little bit better, so I'm going to attempt to eat some of these Cadbury milk eggs. So I'll let you know how many I eat. I feel bad that this whole video has literally been me eating in bed, but it's where we kind of eat when we're just chilling out for the day. We'll just come to bed and 
uh, put something on and then eat our food. Not every day, obviously, but yeah, today that's been the way it's been. So I'm sorry that every location has literally been me in bed, but I hope you're still enjoying this video and watching me fail at eating 10,000 calories. Cheers to a Cadbury egg. Mm. Oh, and they're like a little bit melted too because it's so hot today. Yes. So, it's 7.12, I'm about to have my last egg. Oh god, I don't know if it's gonna focus on that. Oh, it did! I don't know if you can see that, but it's 75 calories for five of them. I'm sure my total so far, snacks and <laughs> breakfast and lunch will come up. Sorry if you can hear Theo, he wants to come up, but we're eating. So, I think I'm gonna leave it at that for now. Try and feel a bit better again, because every time I eat, the sickness just comes back. And if I feel better, I might order some dinner. I'll see how I go, but... I just keep feeling so nauseous and I really don't want to push it, so see how I go. But we're not even halfway to 10,000. <laughs> oh well. We can just call this I ate as many calories as I could. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, I'm back with some dinner. We have Domino's, and I don't know why I'm holding up the chips. This is more evident that it's Domino's. I got a, oh my god, look at that. A pepperoni pizza with extra cheese on gluten free because I figured I may as well stop giving my body some gluten while I can. This is about 4,800 calories, I want to say, because it's about 4,600 or a bit less without extra cheese. So, yeah, that's what I'm going to say that is. I probably won't eat all of it because, again, I'm not feeling very well. I'm going to see how I go. I also got some chips because, whilst they always arrive soggy because I get them delivered. They taste so good. If you haven't tried Domino's chips, definitely give them a go. They're really, really good. And then my weakness, so I get them with every meal when I have a cheat meal. It's currently 8.14. I don't know if you can see that. So, yeah, a bit of a late dinner, but I had to wait until I could fit something else in. <laughs> You know, you're full when even drinking water hurts your stomach. I think I'm done. This um, camera is not focusing because it's a bit dark in the room. Sorry about that. Yes, I think I am done. I have calculated the rest of the calories that I just ate. So it came to the pizza that I had, I had half of it. So that came to 573 calories. And the chips, I had about half of those as well. That came to 391. Um, and then I've also got that Zinger slider that won't go into pay, um, PayPal, as I say, won't go into my fitness pal. So I've added that all up with the current calories on the app, and it came to 5,204 calories. I got just over halfway, but I'm calling it quits. <laughs> I can't do it anymore. I hope you aren't disappointed that I couldn't eat 10,000 calories. I honestly thought I might have had a chance, but as soon as I finished breakfast, I was like, there's no chance that I'm going to be able to like do that plus more for two more meals. So, yes. Sorry, this lighting is so terrible. The light above me doesn't work, so this is what we've got working with us. But I guess that concludes this video as I'm done with the 10,000 calorie challenge. I gave it a good go. Are you proud of me? Yeah. All those cows. 
problem. I, I don't know. You might have been able to do it. Like, I don't think you'd ever be able to do it. I think it's just like not in your body to be able to do no. that. No, it's just different people, different metabolisms, different uh, appetites. Um, your body gets used to eating a certain amount of calories. I guess there's a lot of factors. So, I mean, maybe I should have been eating a certain way a couple of days before. Maybe I should have worked out more today. Maybe. We probably only just would have been able to do it together. Yeah, oh my God, right? We wouldn't even do it together. I got just over halfway. And we also started at after nine o'clock. Some yeah. people get up at like 5 a.m. so they can complete it, which I can now see why they do that because that gives them so many more hours of recovery. Yeah, true, you get like an extra meal in. Yeah, literally. Yeah. They wake up and have a bunch of food. Oh well. Maybe I was we'll about to say again. next time, but. 200,000, <laughs> we'll try again. Oh god, no, maybe if I hit 500,000, we can do that again. <laughs> and I will suck seed. So, yes, don't forget to give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it. I'm so sorry I couldn't hit 10,000 calories. I hope I haven't disappointed you all. <laughs> But yeah, don't forget to subscribe as well if you want to be a part of my YouTube family. It would mean the absolute world to me. And who knows what video I'll be doing for 200,000. So yeah, definitely make sure you subscribe. And hopefully I'll see you in my next video. Bye guys!